All right, guys, we're on a truck. Got my bow. There's Robin. He ready to shoot some. The dogs are right in here. You can hear the dogs are ready to go. We're going out of the fields. We're going to try to shoot some pheasant. Wish us luck. Let's get it. What's going on, guys? It's Donovan with Team Tate Outdoors today. Today I'm in Hunter, Kansas. Getting ready to go do some uh, pheasant hunting and some chucker hunting, and we're gonna be trying to shoot them with our bow. So stick with us, guys. It ought to be awesome. Gonna be a lot of action. We are at Quail Quest up here in Hunter, Kansas. So if you guys wanna look them up, check them out. Try to shoot one with my bow today. If you guys haven't already, go down there and hit the like and subscribe button, and let's get into the action. Oh. Oh, I swear I hit that bird. Right Just, over I the mean, top. Right over the top. The top again. Back. Golly. All right. Watch the blocker stand easy. Trooper back. Trooper. Grant. Daisy. Keep moving. walking, guys. Keep walking. It's moving. There it is. You got one with your gun. See you there. Back. My bird. Oh, there you got it. Oh. Bird down, guys. Oh. Bird down. Them dogs working is awesome. Get ready for private back. Good girl, Daisy. Hold. Move up. Back. Back. Go ahead. Private get bird. There it is! Nice! Oh! Who got There it is! There it is! Who got it? Who got it? Hunt it again? Yeah. Hey, it's back. Copper, my bird, right here. Who shot that last bird? I truly. Yeah? I think I got some good the, photo. Ask him about the rooster he Oh, gets. beautiful rooster gets up at Joey's feet right over my head and I go swing and a miss. Oh, the man. Worst. Felt like crying. Well, that one was good. Shot yeah. that I shot two that round. Yes, I got one. Yeah. yeah, yeah so we, we got, got three. Butt, oh, yeah. The dogs are killing them. Absolutely killing them. They got hey, two on this. That That's hilarious. We got some birds, guys, down. I've yet to shoot one. These guys are doing pretty good, but uh, we're going to try to get one right on the ground right now. We got a good little patch here. These bird, these bird dogs are working awesome. So Thank you. I'm proud of them. Yeah, they're awesome. Dogs. All right, let's get in there and get them. This bird was so close to me that when it flushed, I couldn't raise my bow fast enough. I took a shot, but I mean, I barely shot in front of him. If he'd have flown just a little faster instead of going straight up, if he'd have flown across, I think I'd have cut his head off. Well, guys, I'm doing horrible. These guys are shotting some pretty good birds, um, but I have had some really close shots too. I just seem to shoot right over top of them like this much. I'm really gonna try to bring my aim down a little bit this time, take a second to shoot. Hopefully we'll put one on the ground. Let's get it. Well, 
Yeah, oh, it's right there. Well, he kicked it. Well, yeah. I saw him there. I just, I just couldn't shoot him on the ground. When this bird flew up, I drew my bow. There was blockers there to the lower right. And as that bird flew up, I took aim, aimed ahead of him, released the arrow. But as I did, someone else shot and the bird buckled right before he got in line with my arrow. It almost looks like I hit him, but I shot just over top of him. He didn't quite make it to my arrow. Let it get out if we swing and walk with him. She's not shooting over his head. Man, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, he's hurt. <laughs> Dead bird. Hey, he's on video. You kill Chucker. Hey. <laughs> All right, guys. Finally. Got him his first bird with an arrow. <laughs> it was a ground shot, but uh, I'm still going to shoot one out of the air, guys. But my very first Chucker ever. Killed him pretty close. He was injured already. The guys had already shot him, but um, but we're gonna get one flying here in a minute. But at least I got some dinner. All right, guys. Well, we are. We just got done having lunch over at the little uh, cafe, and now we're heading out for the second part of the afternoon hunt. And it's um, we're gonna be hunting a little bit different area, hunting some grass. I'm still trying to shoot one with the bow. I'm probably crazy in a whatever. These guys have shotguns and they've got, we've got several birds on the ground. I think we got 20 out of the 30 that we were, uh, we were hunting after that we saw. But I'm gonna try to get one. It's the old Oneida today. Stick with us, ought to be a good time. Way behind. Good shot, Ben. Perfect. Shot. Way behind it. Way right. behind. Daisy's on another one. Get up there, Donovan. He hit it. You didn't hear it. All right, guys. Well, cut his leg off. I, I lamed one right there. Dang, that's awesome. I lamed him, but uh, they followed up with a nice little backup shot. But I saw the feathers fly off. You can see it in the video. The feathers fly off. I was just a little low, but I took its foot off, hit it, so it wasn't going nowhere. When it landed, it would have been roughed up. But they finished it off. Got my first bird with a bow. Their leg. <laughs> that, is that is my trophy. That is my trophy. Right there. Clean freaking slice. Cut his leg off in mid flight. If I'd have been a little higher, you'd have killed it. You'd have killed this guy. Here. Regardless, I just hit a pheasant flying. And that's hard to do. 
So I put that as a as a uh, success in my story. Pheasant hunting with a bow, guys. You saw it right there. If you want to go on a cool hunt and pheasant hunting, quail hunting with with good dogs, you can't beat it. Oh, they sent a sub out. Quail okay. Quest oh, over here in Kansas. Yeah, Hunter, know. Kansas. You guys gonna come try it? We're gonna go try to kill some more. Here we go. Uh -huh. Never underestimate how fast these birds are flying. But to shoot a bird in mid-flight while he's flying is very hard to do. You can see here, I just barely missed this bird just over the top of him. But I had a blast with Quell Quest. It was amazing. Well, guys, that was pretty much the trip. We uh, shot a bunch of birds. We're going to go back to the camp now and look at them. Take some photos and uh, get them breasted out and get ready to go home. All right, guys, so I'm with our guide, Paul. Now, Paul kind of relates to me because Paul is a retired Command Sergeant Major. He retired 14 years ago, right, Paul? Yep. And he's been up here doing these hunts and stuff. And so, uh, Paul, tell them, tell them about like what to expect when they come here and, and uh, what's the phone number to get a hold of them right here at Quell Quest. I mean, basically, you come out here, and, and we do groups of anywhere from, we've done from two to, to all the way to eight to ten. Um, so, you know, it just depends on the group. Uh, we'll take you in. Uh, you'll get to meet your guides. You'll sign in uh, with your KD, uh, KDP number, and uh, then we'll take you out and hunt, you know, morning. Usually start at 8.30 and uh, get done about 11.30, 12, have about an hour, hour and a half for lunch, and then do it again in the afternoon until about 16.30 hours, so, so 1600 so. I mean, it's really cool to watch good dogs work and, and get on point and be able to walk up and flush them birds. And so I, I had a super blast time. I know all the guys that we brought with us did, and we appreciate all your hard work. Oh, I, I, we had, a, we had a, a great time having you guys here. And, and like you said, you know, working the dogs, that's the reason I do this. I mean, that's the sole reason I do it is to, to watch the dogs work and, and meet new people. I mean, you guys are from Oklahoma and that's everything right. else. So we get people from all over the United States come in here. And, uh, you know, we treat them like family. And that's how, how we, we want to ensure they have a great hunt. So we try our, our hardest. Well, we sure. had we had a blast. So, and, and we really appreciate your service. Uh -huh. uh, 30 years is a long time to be over there. S seven combat tours, you said? Yep. And so you're all in one piece. I yep. mean, you probably peppered up a little bit. For the most but, part, I, I do have some pepper in yeah. them. But, uh, yeah. But yeah. But this is a good gig to be after retirement and, uh, and to enjoy the dogs and hunters and and just watch birds flush all day. And yeah. what a what a blast. Well, guys, we appreciate you watching uh, right here on Team Tate Outdoors. And remember, go down there, hit the like and subscribe button. And like always, we'll catch you on the next video. We'll see you.